Okay. We're gonna open up this bad boy right here. Uh, like I said, these are the latest ones from the Ninja Turtles um, vintage or whatever. But remember, if you haven't seen my interview or my uh, my Instagram videos and my South ones, you gotta be careful when you look for the eyes. Make sure the eyes are actually looking at you. There's some are across there, some are like way out there, like he's drunk. And uh, if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's kind of funny actually. And um, I do like the yellow card better. So here we go. Well, that was kind of easy to open. Accessories. And like I said so many times, people keep these because when a third print card comes out, at least you have the original and a second print. It's kind of weird for some people like me because we like stuff like that. So we get a tea machine and a new card. And now we'll put those over there. Here's the back card. It looks the same, it looks good. And now we try to open him up or get him out of there. Actually, yeah, this is arms, it's the only one that's tied down. Okay. There. I'm gonna push it back. And he falls out. Here we go. It looks pretty good. Good health. I mean, not good health. Good print. Hand moves. Everything looks good. Everything looks good. Got with his arm is actually backwards. So awesome. I have the other version now. Um, if you haven't seen my other reviews, someone will save. Okay, we got where is it? 2012 Viacon. I really don't think you can see this. There you go. And of course, Playmates. Don't forget Playmates Toys. This one actually has that street and Hong Kong. And over here it says Man China. But you gotta remember the Hong Kongs are actually on the new yellow cards now. Uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, if you have the original open up from 2012, like actually from 2012, the purple card, and it's open, uh, they don't have that on there. They have uh, Made in California. So, you better want to check those out. But now I have my own. Yay! And of course, uh, accessories. Oh, let's me. Yeah. So, here's the accessories. They, of course, is not all fully painted. It's the Ninja Star. And a lot of people are like, oh no, Michelangelo has swastikas. No, it's a Buddha symbol. Case, in case you guys haven't noticed that, yeah, believe it or not, people actually were or like, oh my god, it looks like Nazis. Ooh. No, no, it's not. It's a Buddha symbol. Nazis just flip it over and make their own version, but it's actually a Buddha symbol, and it means peace. So people don't freak out. Don't listen to those people. Really, don't listen to those people. And of course, on top, it tells you who it belongs to. We got Mikey or Mike, really. And then. The nunchucks are actually tied in there. That's kind of weird. Okay, so they're making it difficult for us. Okay, did I just tie it up or did it work off? There it goes. There's that. Oh, there goes that. Jeez, people. Take a time on this, but you won't take a time on painting him. Ooh. Right. Got that out. Voila. And we got Mikey. I don't like putting the nunchucks on the back because, oh, you could do like this. That'd be cool. I mean, pretty sure that's what it meant to be. But if you remember the old school turtle toys, you actually put two and, you know, one, one in here, one in here. But when you do, it would actually um, bend this a little bit really bad because it will make it like a white color and when you keep bending it it's going to break right off so please be careful with your stuff the paint job looks kind of off a little bit not too much 
So let's put him on here. Yeah, I don't know if it's because of my eyes or what, but that white part actually looks kind of orange, kind of like. Maybe they've switched the wrong or didn't, you know, clean their brush it right. I don't know. So we got Michelangelo open. So now I have one of this version open. Yay! So um, once I get my stuff from California, um, I'll put the other guys in here so you can see all of them together. And I can take better pictures together, you know, the different version of these guys. So, as you can see, 2014, you're going to stay in there. Well, actually, I don't think I have one of him open. I need to find another one that's oh, his eyes are open. These are seriously hard to find now. I kid you not. If you find one with the white eyes, please get them right away. And if you already have them, you're okay with that, then get the one with the, the M print because those are going to go bye bye. Because we're going to be going with painted eyes and no painted initials or anything like that so wide eyes uh, the next print is gonna have wide eyes also but it's gonna have like less paint job and it's gonna be like I don't know how you, like black shadows it's really weird looking but kind of cool at the same time same weapons and everything same card same background everything is so cool over here And then the next one, I'll put you guys over there. And the next one is one with the painted eyes. The eyes are perfectly straight. And the M's on right. Same thing. It just, like I said, it's really weird because, yeah. I, seriously, I really didn't notice the whole non painted M. And I got, what was it? I got the other one first. First, no, I got this one first, and I got the other one, and I thought I had the painted M on there. I was like, all right, cool. But I wasn't all there in the head, I guess you say. And when I, I woke up and looked at my little wall over here with my turtle toys like, hanging on the wall, I noticed there was no imprint. I'm like, whoa, wait a minute. That's where I started posting it up about it, and now I'm, now I finally found with the imprint, so whew, thank goodness. So, yeah, anyway, same thing. Uh, 2015 over here everything looks the same uh, same uh, website let's see because Leonardo have different paint job and this one looks about the same kind of and then of course the one I just open up but there's one I closed and that's what he looks like also, with blue eyes, no painted M, same weapon. Uh, actually, I kind of noticing the one with, with the painted M one, actually his nunchucks are lighter. Uh, this one's a little bit darker. And this one looks a little bit more darker than this one over here. The back, still the same, nothing really new on the back. Or there's Mockman on there. We're believe it or not, we're actually getting a Mockman, so don't worry about it, guys. We are going to get one. They confronted finally. All right, guys, so that's my Michelangelo stuff for right now. Um, this video, like I said, is it is March 2nd. And once I complete all of my Michelangelo, Michelangelo Vintage before this, hopefully before the two new ones come out, um, I will, re will release this video. Because I don't want to make it too long of a video, but I want to make sure everything is in properly right for, for all the vintage collectors out there. So remember, write your, take a pen and paper and write all this stuff down, so what to, what to expect, which one you have and all that stuff. Um, so... Let's continue later on this journey, I guess you'd say.